Only on NBC5 News tonight, the countdown is on for the Grants Pass Balloon and Kite Festival. For three days, balloons and kites will take over Southern Oregon skies, and overseeing it all is one man, the Balloon Meister. It's one thing to see it up close. That's really pretty magical. It's another to see it from inside. Yeah. And if you're lucky enough to be headed to the clouds in a basket beneath a balloon, you want someone like Robert Raper at the helm. I'm living my dream. You could say the organ pilot has a little experience. 1,600. Okay, a lot. <laughs> but even with all those hours under his belt, each time he takes off, he's reminded of what a unique experience ballooning offers. The sensation of powered flight, like what you would get in a commercial jet and, and small fixed wing and helicopters, you feel the, the G-force. In a balloon, you feel nothing. This is beautiful. And oftentimes, you're so distracted with just what you're looking at, you lose all concept of, of going up in the air. Raper will be the balloon meister at this weekend's festival. He's in charge of checking the gear and the conditions to make sure it's safe to fly. This trip is the final test run. And I don't want to go over that way. I can absolutely control going up, going down. Everything else I have to find. That means it's not all that uncommon that a front yard is transformed into a landing site. Don't land on my house, is what he said. I, I think that was his exact quote. That's when those 1,600 hours of practice come in handy. I can slip into a pretty tight street when it's this gentle. This weekend, that street could be yours, though the landing is only half the fun. You watch it leave. I mean, you see it in Wizard of Oz, and it feels magical just like that when you see it in person. Magic that everyone can get a taste of come Friday. All of the rides this weekend are sold out, but there are six spots up for grabs on Sunday morning. If you volunteer at the event, you earn a chance to win. Visit our website for more information on that as well as all of the events taking place beginning Friday.